retirees with mechanical problems. Turn four again. This time it's Merv Trichler, another Northeast modified driver, hard and ball, but Merv was not injured. Bobby Allison had the year's first pace car encounter as he retired on lap 79. Earnhardt's demise was signaled when he dropped low on the track and watched the others pass in the high groove. Then with less than seven laps to go, a multi-car crash between turns one and two takes out Bill Elliott, but it obviously had no effect on his performance the next day. The green comes out with one lap to go. Jeff Bodine gets the jump. Then in turn number four, Daryl Waltrip looks strong. But Jeff holds off the challenge and wins in one of the few V8s in the field. It was his second win in as many days.